Welcome to footballgameplan.com, where football makes sense. I'm Emery Hunt, the czar of the playbook here at the 2018 Reese's Senior Bowl with tight end Dallas Goddard of South Dakota State. Appreciate you taking time. Yes, thank you for having me. This is my second week in a row meeting a jackrabbit. You know, last week I saw Jake Winnicky. Here I'm seeing you. I love it. Representing. You, you guys you know, all over the place. We got we got great people there, so it's a lot of fun. A lot of receptions, a lot of yards, a lot of touchdowns. And what's interesting about both you guys, and you in particular, teams knew you were the, the go-to guy. Yet you still find yourself to be open all the time and find yourself to make the play when they needed it the most. How were you able to work through that knowing teams came in to try to take you away? Yeah, there was definitely uh, teams that would game plan. Uh, they double, triple team me and stuff like that. But uh, what was tough for them is that our coaching staff did a great job of moving me from position to position, lining up in the backfield. Uh, if I can catch the ball, uh, they can't double team me out of there, you know. So the coaches did a great job uh, being able to move me around, uh, be able to get me uh, in the best position to win. You mentioned moving in and out of the backfield, right? And I think that's unique because we didn't usually see that in this in this era of football until now. You have to move tight end, you have to age back, you have to inline. You can do essentially all three. What do you see your skills being best utilized, or would you rather be the guy that can do all three? You know, I um, I, I want to be the guy that can do all three. Uh, the more times you can be on the field, the better. I like playing football, so I want to be on the field, and I want to get on the field any way possible. Um, but, you know, I like doing it all. Um, they definitely have perks to different sides, uh, being spread out. You know, uh, you get to go against uh, – you don't have to go against the big DNs and everything. <laughs> but being inside, it's the same thing. Uh, you get a – be able to beat a bigger guy, you know, uh, be able to win at that level. So I, I enjoy doing all three of them. I watched a lot of you guys' games in the Missouri Valley Conference. You know, they could call it the SEC of the FCS, how you guys get out there and compete top to bottom with all the playoff teams you guys have. When you look at the Missouri Valley, as far as prepping you for this opportunity, how did that conference help prep you to get out here and showcase your skills? Yeah, you know, uh, playing in the Missouri Valley Conference, it was a uh, a tough game every week. Um, you had to go out there and bring your best, and if you didn't, you were going to get beat. So, uh, you know, just not having any time off, um, going competing every day, uh, every game, every practice, uh, trying to get better just because you knew you were playing a good opponent coming up uh, definitely helped me in this process. And final question, I noticed on the field you have a lot of passion, and it takes passion to play your position and to play it well. What is it about the game that you love the most? Oh, just everything. I mean, I love competing. I love talking a little bit of trash. Um, I love just the poetry of the game, knowing that it takes all 11 people to make a play work. Um, that's what I love about football, that it's not uh, – you can have the best player on the team and the best player in the world, mm -hmm. and uh, if he doesn't have people around him, he's not going to be very good, uh, which in a lot of sports isn't the case. So I just love the team aspect of it, uh, going out there and competing. Man, you did a great job in college. We wish you the best of luck moving forward. Thank you. I appreciate it. No problem.